Good night. All right. Thank you for your time. I appreciate it. Uh, my name is John Brislin. Uh, my idea here is called Give and Take. So this is an idea that I've been working on for um, a few years now. It's, um, it's evolved over the years, about several years. Um, I went far off from the original idea and I did, about, I did a complete 360 and came back to, to where it all started. Um, what gave me the idea, what inspired me for Give and Take was a, uh, an unplanned, uh, spontaneous night. A couple of my buddies living right across the street from a stone's throw away from me on Sarah Ave. Um, and they were, we, were, we were all students here, undergraduate students, and they had two refrigerators in their apartment. And it, you know, it was a joke. Guys, why do you have two fridges, you know, for, for a couple months? One night I showed up and, and the fridge was gone. Um, so I asked, you know, what happened? And they all had a smile on their face. And they're like, it's a funny story. Actually, what happened was, you know, we were looking to try to get ways to get rid of it, to have someone come pick it up. You know, they didn't have a truck, they didn't have any money. Um, they call the students. Um, so what they, they said, they had enough one day and they, they just muscled it down to the end of their driveway. And within five, 10, 15 minutes, two guys, like they knew it was there, drove right up, threw it on the back of their truck and were gone. Um, and they were laughing, you know, cause it's like, wow, it was that easy. And that night it gave me an idea um, as simple as some people I noticed and from growing up in the Merrimack Valley, um, going to school in Lawrence, um, I noticed inequality. Some people have, some people don't. And um, it was a simple thing that night, but they gave away something that they had extra for free, um, just out of faith. Um, and somebody that needed it took it. And it was just, it was that simple of an idea. Um, and I thought, you know, what if there was an online network? What if there was a website that we could go to when we had something extra that we wanted to give away? Um, and that's how we could take it. My, in my mind. Give and Take, my vision for Give and Take is a, a global community of sharing. I hope to build an online network creating the opportunity for the free exchange of goods, ideas, and services. My philosophy is, if, and what I've learned in life is, the more I give, um, the more we give, the more we receive. I think that's a universal law. Um, and the main problem that I see in the world today, and I think the president would agree with me, is inequality. Um, I think we see it everywhere. And a solution that I have is as simple as sharing more. Um, it's something that we as a people have done for the hip, you know, as long as we've been here. Um, and in recent history, I, I feel like we've kind of strayed from that. Um, the problem is inequality, and the solution, I, I think, is sharing. Sharing more, and give and take can help us do that, hopefully. I'm gonna ask you guys to imagine uh, differences that you could see in the world if we shared more. Um, this is a quote that I came across doing my own research on Native American history. Is there not something worthy of perpetuation in our Indian spirit of democracy, where Earth, our mother, was free to all, and no one sought to impoverish or enslave his neighbor? Oh, yeah. oh hi, Yisa said that. Um, I think there's a lot of truth in that, and I think that we can learn a lot from that. Um, some of the problems that we have today. I apologize, uh, I do need to work on getting this off under five minutes. Um, it's a big idea, but what I want you guys to know is that it's a, there are solid concrete steps that we can take right now. What I'm trying to build is a network where people can go online and find each other, connect with each other. There's something that we have that's extra, and there's something that you need that, that you don't have. I want to give it to you for free. No strings attached because I think that everybody deserves to have what they need to discover and pursue their passion. I was given that by coming to this university and, and Endicott University. I was given what I, what I needed to discover and pursue my passions. I want everybody else to have that. 
And at the same time, I think that if we share more, we will be able to waste less, pollute less, and um, build a camaraderie, build more of a community by doing so. So I'm looking for web designers and web developers, and I'm looking for people that are passionate about helping. So thank you for your time. Do you want to have any questions?
gone back and forth on, you know, is it good enough to do it, is it not? You guys gave me an opportunity to really work hard on it and get something physical to manifest to get it to this point. I see a lot of work that I need to do on this, and I'm looking for a lot of talented kids um, and people to help to join this. Um, I just need a chance. Um, I see a potential to make a lot of money. Um, I remember when Facebook was first coming out and all over the news, you know, where's the money? How's it going to make money? Um, and I can see that Mark, uh, you know, he, he was smart enough to figure out a way to make the money, but he, he, he had a passion. And, um, but he had a business model too. Okay. He, he knew exactly what he was doing. <laughs> okay. yeah. Well, my, my business model would be the advertising and the potential for um, a transportation company to work with, give and take. Um, those two would be my biggest um, earners, um, you know, money making. But, but really, the whole point of this is to foster an environment where people can share, they can connect, they can um, give. Um, and inequality is, is the problem, and give and take is the solution in my mind, because we all have unique gifts, and if we all share those gifts with each other, I think um, we can create a, a different world. Good. Thank you, John. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.